Hello there guys, welcome back, Evans here, and today we have just turned Black Ops 4 on to do a gun game gameplay, but instead I have found that, that there's been an update, and we have the Black Ops Pass Rewards, 1000 COD points and 300 Nibelium Plasma, whatever that is, I'm guessing that's for zombies, I have not played zombies yet, I still need to get around to doing it, but uh, let's see what the new update is, I haven't even seen this yet, so let's see what it goes, how it goes, there. Thank you for purchasing Black Ops 4 Pass. As a special thank you, all Black Ops 4 Pass owners get a thousand COD points and 300 Nebelium Plasma effective immediately. Redeem your rewards now. Redeem. Are you sure you want to redeem Black Ops Pass? Of course I do. Yeah boy, success. Okay then, close. So as I seen up there, I have 3000. So let's click this unfor unfor unforbidden. Un Disgusting store cod points. Here we go. It's back. Not not the best thing. I'm not happy. I'm seeing this, but I mean, it, it's expected. It's expected. Cod points. It's going to be in every cod. So let's see where you have to go. So black uh, black market. Okay. Okay. So okay. So they're going to give you the option to get cod points for free, which is getting this purchase tier fifty. Uh, okay. So you can. Hmm, this is weird. So if I click square, tier 50 for 100. Co okay, so I'm guessing you can, you might be able to skip. So if I, so if I say go to tier 70, that's going to cost me 2,000 cod points. So if you don't feel like you're going to get to 200 or whatever, you could buy your way there, which seems a bit odd. Um, purchase 15,000 to get from 50 to 200. Okay, that's interesting. That's interesting. I still have not seen this. So how do you get this? Ends in two days, twenty-two hours. Special offer: eight hundred cod points. Purchase. Or can you only purchase it? Do you not purchase. Uh, purchase a special offer and progress tiers to unlock all ten items. Oh, okay. So I would I would have suspected you would have got that for free being a pass owner, but you have to buy extra tiers that's a bit rubbish I've paid for the pass so why do I have to pay to get a legendary firebreak I mean I don't even use firebreak why would I buy it so I, I'm not gonna lie Call of Duty that's a bit that's a bit crappy that legendary offer there should be for pass owners not just because you want to make some money I like the idea of unlocking more tiers and more stuff to unlock but come on I mean, it's a joke, but Blackjack Shop, so there's something else coming, Blackjack was a specialist in Black Ops 3, so we need to wait and see what that is, but special offers, so you can purchase these two, so this one's 500 and you get a Seraph outfit, again, don't really use Seraph, I would like to, but I don't know if I want to waste 500 COD points on it. I mean, uh, f so both of them, 800 and 500, what's that, 1,300-ish. So I'd need to spend 17 quid, or maybe what, I'd need, to I'd need to spend 10 quid minimum to get it. Just to get two extra, two extra things. I don't think so. I mean, you get a couple of emblems and stuff like that, but nothing special. I mean, if it was a gun, I'd think about it. If it was a good one that I like the look of, possibly, but... I'd also like to just unlock them for free by playing the game loads. <laughs> um, but I mean, they've updated stuff. Uh, they haven't up they haven't put supply drops in, so that's that's something else. Uh, can I see anything else that has been updated at all? Um, I'll probably miss something. I always do. Uh, nothing here. I think it is just literally the black market that you can do so we, we're wait, still waiting on blackjack's shop um, and we have these special offers so obviously the the rare is cheaper than the legendary um, and they would re renew every three days by the looks of it so every three days we're going to be getting a new new ones of these but that seems a lot roughly 10 pound every three days i mean i don't think anyone's going to put that much money into this game because that is a lot of money. I mean, that's 20 quid in a week. So, minimum you're looking at is, what, 80 quid a month? If you're getting three, uh, two more every day and you're actually buying them both. 
I mean, I won't be buying any, well, I, I won't be buying many if I do, I've got 3,400 COD points, so maybe if I get one that I really like the look of, I might think about it with my COD points that I already have. Um, I mean, I've just got those free COD points from buying Black Ops 4 and getting the Season Pass, or Black Ops Pass. Um, I, sp I do suppose being able to buy your way up the tiers if you're not very good or you don't get to play it often if you really see something you like but again I won't be doing it I'll just play it as much as I can and uh, hopefully get up hopefully get up the tiers um, but I think that's all um, I can't see anything else that I've missed let me I'll click on blackout I'll see if I've missed anything else um, so it's given me the rundown of what to do in Blackout again. I know what to do, I've played it loads. <laughs> um, again, not seen anything that has changed. Again, Black Market's just the same. Uh, we've got challenge, we, we, you, uh, I can't even speak. You can unlock some of these things, the challenges. Uh, as you can see, I have one of the multiplayer guys, I've got Torque. So the challenges are ready. Um, they were, they've been ready for a wee while. Um, we just need to, so there's nothing there, and uh, last but not least, we're going to zombies. Um, and we'll see, yes, I, zombies is there, tutorial, setup, yep. So, no, I don't know if there's, I, I want to say the lab 3 might be new, but I don't know, because like I said, I haven't played it, but, okay, so this is the same as Black Ops 3 again, you can, uh, you can make new things or make uh, use these potions to uh, make more so I don't know if 300 is a lot or not um, but again I don't think there's much changed as you can see I am level 1 armory I don't know um, but yeah nothing nothing's changed you've got this uh, Halloween calling card I don't know how long that, that's been there I'm guessing it's been there for a wee while because it ends in one day 22 hours a uh, special event, get 1,500 kills, I probably won't make that. I could try and do a game today and tomorrow, might be able to get 1,500 kills, probably would if I played it quite a bit. I need to, I, I really do need to play zombies. But um, as, I, as far as I can see guys, that is all that this Black Ops update brings to us. Choose playlist, have they done any more playlists? Not gun game, and that is it, no more. No more fancy playlists, no more changes in the playlists. Uh, so that's all I can see for this update, guys. So uh, I hope you like this. I think Xbox guys are going to be another week behind us. I think they always are. Um, they have been a week uh, Well, I think they're always going to be a week behind. Um, obviously, because of the deal PlayStation have. Um, but there is... They did do an update yesterday, which is what we, we we had to update yesterday, and that was a nerf to quite a few things. They buffed a few things as well in the, the armor and audio and playlists, um, but online I cannot seem to find anything about this update today. Um, so I think today was just them releasing the COD points again and uh, updating the black market and giving you special orders. So. I'm a bit bummed out about that, I'm not going to lie, uh, leave a comment on what you guys think as well, I think, uh, I don't think COD points, sh I don't like COD points, I mean who wants to spend money on a game when you've already bought the game, but COD points are never going to go away now that they have them, um, Call of Duty was perfect back in the day, Call of Duty 4, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, we didn't have to put money in the game afterwards, apart from your, uh, your, your map packs and stuff like that, that was the day, that was you know that was the best time of Call of Duty now they're just you know they're making money on this COD points they're never going to get rid of it um, and yes okay they add more to the game but I mean that's what the season pass is for you spend an extra 40 quid or whatever on the game so I mean you don't really want to be spending it more money every month on it um, but we'll see we'll see what they do they might uh, change some of this up uh, depending on if a lot of people buy them, then they're going to keep this. If nobody buys them, they're just going to get rid of it properly. We'll, we'll just need to we'll just need to wait and see uh, what actually happens. But yeah, guys, leave a leave a comment on uh, if you are happy with this update. If you aren't, 
or if you are going to buy some of these uh, these character skins fair play if you do um, if you really like getting every single one in the game that's something that you like doing but I don't like putting any more money on my COD points um, I didn't buy any on World War 2 and I won't be buying any I probably won't be buying any of the now unless something fantastic comes out and you know you can get guns you're definitely going to get a gun then I might but I like the supply drops where you unlock them through the matches and then you got the chance of winning a gun that was amazing on World War 2 but I certainly won't be spending a fortune on COD points so thank you guys for watching please leave a like comment and subscribe if you just can um, always like hearing back from people in the comments I reply to every comment I can so well I reply to every comment so <laughs> leave a comment guys and uh, I will catch you in the next video see you later